In this example, we want to determine whether this series uh, is conditionally or absolutely convergent. Okay, so let's check the first few terms because it appears that this series looks like it may be altering, but let's just check to see. So when n is 1, okay, we're going to get minus 1 third. When n is 2, we get minus 1 ninth. When n is 3, okay, we're going to get 1 over positive 1 over 27. Okay, and then for the fourth term, okay, we're going to get a positive value here. Okay, so it appears that this is not an uh, alternating series. Okay, and we can see that here because we get negative, negative, then positive. So if it were alternating, then we have to get uh, alternating signs. Okay, so that's why it's a good idea to check the first few terms just to make sure that it's alternating or not. So we cannot apply the alternating series test here. Okay. Okay, so what we can do, okay, um, in this case, what we can do, we can use another theorem. So we can take the absolute value of this, and if that's converging, then that means the original one will converge. Okay, so let's just recall that property. Okay, so recall. Okay, if, oops, sorry. If the series okay, if we take the absolute value of the term of the nth term of that series, and if that's converging, then the original series converges. Okay, so we can apply that here. Okay, so we're going to take the absolute value of the nth terms. Okay. So this is going to give us, okay, when we take the absolute value of the nth term, the negatives become positive, right? So we end up getting 1 over 3 to the n, okay? And this is the same thing as writing, okay, okay this is the same thing as the series, the summation of 1 third to the power n. Okay, so this is a geometric series with r equals to one third. And so therefore, since r is less than one, this is converging. Okay, so what this tells us is that, that uh, this tells us that because we took the, the absolute value of the nth term and, and came up with a series that converges, therefore the original series converges. Okay. okay. So that tells us, okay, um, right, that means because we took the absolute value and it's converging, so this is, means, this implies that this original series uh, is absolutely converging, okay? Okay, so it's absolutely converging as well. Okay, so we have a result.